Hello, Nagi soldiers. I hope you people are doing well. So, I welcome all of you to Jama Jam Nagi Trick Temperature Distribution for Plain Wall, Hollow Cylinder, and Hollow Spherical Cell. So, one by one, we are going to discuss the short trick related to all these things, my friend. So, let us see. 1D in bracket X direction steady state heat conduction without heat generation through plane wall having constant properties. So here I am talking about here I am talking about what plane wall and what are the assumptions I am having 1D in bracket X direction steady state heat conduction I am having 1D in bracket X direction steady state heat conduction without heat generation through the plane wall having constant properties so dekho beta isme kya hota hai main aapko short trick batata hu kya hai iska temperature distribution ka formula bahut easy hai beta look at here plane wall how the temperature varies for such case of plane wall 100% linearly temperature will be varying linearly with x direction ठीक है अब ध्यान से देखना बेटा क्या फार्मूला आता है मैं बताता हूं देखो व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ लीनियरली स्ट्रेट लाइन बेसिकली द मीनिंग ऑफ लीनियरली इज स्ट्रेट लाइन सो आई होप यू आर एबल टू रिकलेक्ट वन ब्यूटीफुल इक्वेशन ऑफ द स्ट्रेट लाइन y minus y1 divided by y2 minus y1 is equal to what x minus x1 divided by what x2 minus x1 so can i write in this way dekho beta y ke jagah bas t rakh do t minus t1 divided by t2 minus t1 is equal to what x minus x1 x1 is 0 divided by x2 minus x1 x2 is capital L but uh, listen carefully listen carefully here I am assuming the thickness of the plane wall is capital L so yaad rakhna beta dekho this is the temperature I will be explaining you little bit this is the temperature at distance x from the left face where I am having x coordinate 0 this is the temperature on the left face where x coordinate is 0 this is the temperature on right face where x coordinate is capital L because I am assuming the thickness of the plane wall is capital L and of course this is the temperature on left face where x coordinate is 0 that's it very easy beta I hope everyone is clear with this formula confirm kar do ek bar excellent 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 ye hui na baat chalo this is about plane wall now let us discuss for hollow cylinder 1D in bracket R direction. What is the meaning of this R direction, beta? Radial direction. Radial direction. 1D in bracket radial direction. Steady state heat conduction. Steady state heat conduction without heat generation. Without heat generation through the hollow cylinder having constant properties. So, yaad rakhna, beta. I am discussing for hollow cylinder. hollow cylinder how the temperature varies for hollow cylinder logarithmically logarithmically temperature varies logarithmically with radial distance what is the meaning of this logarithmically i hope aapko samajh mein aayega logarithmically kaisa aayega beta ln aayega na somewhere ln will come that's it. Chalo, I have formula likhe dikhata hu. Bahut easy hai, beta. Bahut easy hai. Please observe carefully. It's very easy. T minus T1. Are same wahi. Left hand side is same. T minus T1 divided by T2 minus T1 is equal to what? Observe carefully. Ln R minus ln R1, capital R1, divided by ln capital R2 minus ln that's it beta listen carefully where capital t is the temperature at some radial distance a small r capital t1 is the temperature on the inner surface of the hollow cylinder at radial distance capital r1 t2 is the temperature on the surface on the outer surface which is at distance at radial distance capital r2 and of course this is on the inner surface which is at radial distance capital R1. that's it beta let us talk about 
hollow spherical cell 1d in bracket radial direction steady state heat conduction steady state heat conduction without heat generation through the hollow spherical cell having constant properties so the answer is now we are talking about hollow spherical cell we are talking about what hollow spherical cell how the temperature is varying here how the temperature is varying here hyperbolically hyperbolically to kaisa hoga beta temperature distribution ek bar dekhna formula kya aayega please observe carefully this will remain same acha hyperbolically ka matlab kya hota hai i hope you are able to collect recollect 1 by r na 1 by r basically 1 by r to dekhna T minus T1 divided by T2 minus T1 is equal to 1 by small r minus 1 by capital R1 divided by 1 by capital R2 minus 1 by capital R1. This is the formula, beta. This is the formula. देखो मैं आपको एक्सप्लेन करता हूं लेट मी एक्सप्लेन यू दिस इज द टेम्परेचर एट रेडियल डिस्टेंस आर डेट्स वाई वी आर हैविंग वन बाय आर वन हेयर दिस इज द टेम्परेचर एट रेडियल डिस्टेंस कैपिटल आर वन दैट मीन्स ऑन द इनर सर्फेस ऑफ द हॉलोस्फेरिकल सेल दिस इज द टेम्परेचर ऑन द आउटर सर्फेस ऑफ द हॉलोस्फेरिकल सेल एट रेडियस कैपिटल आर टू दिस इज द टेम्परेचर ऑन द इनर सर्फेस ऑफ द हॉलोस्फेरिकल सेल एट रेडियल डिस्टेंस कैपिटल आर वन लेट मी एक्सप्लेन यू अगेन बेटा बेटा ध्यान से देखना प्लेन वॉल के लिए प्लेन वॉल के लिए कैसे वेरी कर रहा था द टेम्परेचर वॉज वेरिंग लीनियरली विद एक्स लीनियरली वेरी कर रहा था ध्यान से देखो इट्स वेरी इजी बेटा टी वेन आई एम हैविंग टी एक्स वन टी वन वेन आई एम हैविंग कैपिटल टी वन वट इज द एक्स कॉर्डिनेट ऑन द लेफ्ट फेस आई एम एज्यूमिंग जीरो टी टू टेम्परेचर ऑन द राइट फेस वट इज द एक्स कॉर्डिनेट ऑन द राइट फेस Capital L T1. What is the x coordinate on the left face? Zero. That's it. Now look at here. In case of hollow cylinder, it was varying logarithmically. So T. When I'm having T, they go logarithmically, na. So I'm having ln r temperature at any radial distance is small r. When I'm having T1, ln capital R1 temperature on the inner surface of the hollow cylinder at radial distance R1. When I am having T2 temperature, temperature on the outer surface of the hollow cylinder at radial distance R2, I am having ln R2. Logarithmically vary kar raha hai na, to bas ln a gaya, R2 a gaya, minus T1. What is the T1 beta? Temperature on the inner surface of the hollow cylinder at radial distance capital R1, that's why I am having ln R1. Yahan dekh lo ek bar. T, when I am having T, how the temperature is varying here? Hyperbolically. What is the meaning of hyperbolically? 1 by R. So when I am having T, 1 by r t is the temperature at any radial distance is small r what is the temperature t1 for the hollow spherical cell temperature t1 is representing the temperature on the inner surface of the hollow spherical cell at distance at radial distance capital r1 so dekho t1 hai to 1 by capital r1 because temperature is varying hyperbolically when i am having t2 t2 is the temperature on the outer surface of the hollow spherical cell that's why i am having 1 by capital r2 T1 is the temperature on the inner surface of the hollow spherical cell at radial distance capital R1, 1 by capital R1 I am having. That's it my friends. If you like the video, agar aapko pasand aya, if you like the video, hit the like button, re baba, subscribe karo, share karo and please comment. Your comments are very important. If you comment, if you comment and if you want, aap mujhe bataiye ki aapko aur short trick chahiye, I will keep on bringing such beautiful short tricks for you people my friends. Look at here my friends, I'm teaching on Unacademy Plus. You can join Unacademy Plus using the referral code Negi10. The moment you are using Negi10, you will be able to unlock live classes. The moment you are unlocking the live classes, you can see the live classes of any educator on Unacademy Plus related to GATE and ESC category. In case you are missing the live classes beta, you can watch the recorded classes. What other benefits you, you will be getting beta? You will be getting the daily practice problems, practice C, doubt clearing solving, doubt clearing session, doubt solving groups. We will be getting the weekly quizzes. 
you will be getting the detailed solutions of the weekly quiz and you need not to worry you need not to worry about the language of the batches but you will be having the batches in both languages hindi and english aapko bilkul chinta hi nahi karni hai. and the most important thing your revision will be our responsibility aapka revision hum log take care karenge in the form of rank improvement batches and crash courses now if you are financially well settled then you can go for an academy iconic using the same raffle code negatan the moment you are using Raffle code Negiton for joining the Unacademy Iconic. Whatever the features are there on Unacademy Plus, you are going to get those features. Other than that, you will be getting personal coach. This personal coach is going to mentor you, guide you one to one. Yes, you will be getting the one to one guidance from this personal coach. And this personal coach will make sure you are getting the customized study planner. This personal coach is going to analyze your weekly quizzes and is going to give you the corrective measures so that you can improve in your future weekly quizzes. At the same time, you will be getting the study booster sessions from the Unacademy where you will learn how to excel in the art of writing the exam how to increase the efficiency of learning and other than that most important thing beta you will be getting the preparatory study material from an academy where you will be having the theory books you will be having the problem books also thank you so much love you all so kindly hit the like button my friends thank you